legalize marijuana, tax the hell out of it, and put every dime back into the healthcare system. Taxation and legalization? Doesn't that seem a little extreme? Wouldn't it be better to just decriminalize? The distinction is simple. Legalization of marijuana makes it a product that is legally available to adults. That doesn't mean that there's unregulated distribution, unregulated sale, and unregulated use. The decriminalization of marijuana still makes it an offense. You're not going to go to jail for it under a decriminalized model, but society is still saying no, 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 no. It doesn't address the problems of organized crime, and it doesn't create um, a situation where you have retail sales. Decriminalization is just kind of a goofy concept. To say that it's legal to own something, to use it, to possess it, but not to produce it or sell it, it just seems like this illogical position because where did this stuff come from? It's the worst of both worlds. It sends out an incredibly bad message. It should be controlled like alcohol, like, like tobacco. The total impact for the U.S. budget from legalizing marijuana and taxing it at rates like alcohol and tobacco is somewhere in the 10 to $14 billion range. It can be used to pay for health care costs. It can be used to rebate to lower taxes and give people lower tax rates. It can be used for highways, for hospitals, for national defense. It's $14 billion and can be used for whatever its best use is. The production or the harvesting, the packaging, the sales of marijuana could be handled essentially the way we handle alcohol. You sell to a kid, you sell to somebody under the influence, your license is in jeopardy. That license ought to be hard to get and easy to lose. 